Okay, so this is a quick video for Stevie Breach. Um, he put a tweet out, and he wanted to know, how did Bret Hart join the NWO and turn heel in the year 2000 and form the NWO 2000, which never worked? Now, if I remember right, there was a spot in the ring where Goldberg and Bret were going at it, and I believe some of the NWO members were outside the ring. And everyone was thinking, oh, Goldberg's going to join the NWO. Oh, Goldberg's going to be the bad guy. And then somehow, someway, Brett picked up the bat, trashed Goldberg with the bat. And uh, that's how Brett wound up joining the NWO um, um, 2000 with Jeff Jarrett. And there was a couple other guys in there. I really have blocked that time frame out from WCW. But yeah, I remember Brett trashing Goldberg with the bat at the end of the match and pulling the heel turn. Brett was never into WCW. He was there for the $2 million contract. Brett was never into anything WCW was doing. The NWO 2000 was not going to work. The only version of the NWO that did work was the original version with Hogan National Hall. We're talking about the year 2000. It was four years into it. Um, it had been done, it had been seen, NWO was played out, but that is your answer, Stevie, about how Brett joined the NWO. Uh, he trashed that Goldberg with the bat, and it was a fail. WCW towards the end was just a, a fail altogether.